Hey guys, it's me again. Um, today I'm going to be reviewing this little program called EasyVid. It's a free movie maker that was cre initially created from track one recordings. They have a YouTube channel and I asked if I can do a review for this little pro free program. They said of course and they would greatly appreciate it. And this is, this is a free movie maker for Windows that could do HD videos, it could, it's ready for YouTube, and it's pretty great. As you see, it's you go to go to your browser and you want to go to easyvid.com, and here's all the random tags, 100% free to use, make a slideshow or a video in 3 minutes, no registration required, direct YouTube upload really fast, and it includes like music that's built in to the program, so you don't have to use other mu other songs that are copyrighted so you don't have to, pre to prevent copyright violations so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the program it's, it's free to download okay I, I got my title I put easy vid video test let me correct it and uh, I'm gonna go and this is I'll go ahead and add my description in here. Okay, now I got my description. And you can choose what songs. Most of the songs are provided by 009 Sound Systems. And I know some people hate their music, but their music seems to be pretty good. And there's the most popular Born to be Wasted, Dreamscape. I'll just use the easy vid. put some random tags okay we got my you can choose the category and I'll also leave this video in the, a link to the description so let's say if you want to add some, I'm going to go ahead and add some clips. I'll use some random clips as you see. Let me find that folder first. Okay, it's generating. Because as you see with Easy Vid, we're going to show you how to splice the clip. And just move it to like, move this little bar right here where, my, where the cursor is, and you want to put it to a certain spot. So if I want to put it right there to a certain length, and we'll go ahead and. Um, And uh, say if we want to add text, you click right there where it says T is. And let's put, you can change, you can even change the color and the font. Let's see what others they got. I use my own custom. Adjust it. Okay, 
to add another clip, you just go to go to where the little thing where it shows like a little clip. And um, if you want to like do a voiceover, it'll do it when. You just click that little mic and it's going to record wherever your wherever the sound is coming from. Here's a let's go ahead and try. It. We'll go ahead and see how it looks so far. Let's say I was gonna use some of my videos to go in it that mostly known on YouTube. Yeah, just you gotta give it a little time for it to um render and stuff like that. And I'm gonna share this little video with y'all with on e my easy vid test. They say it's easier than iMovie. And it's pretty nice, pretty decent movie making software, movie editing. You can adjust the zoom. I'll go ahead and pause. Alright, now I'm back. Since I've repaused to the video to the video since I had to pause a little bit so so it don't take too long of your time. You just do the same thing if you want to add text you can good. Okay, you want to say you want to upload to YouTube? You just want to click yes. Now you just gotta do is put in your YouTube information. Access. All you just gotta do is let it render. You can even do a new project when you finish. So, this is my review for EasyVid. So, comment, like, and um, subscribe. And I'm learning it, still kind of learning it though. But I see, it seems to be a little great basic movie editor. So, hope you enjoyed watching my video. So, thank you very much for watching. So.
and don't forget to, to subscribe.